Good morning, you beautiful followers. This is the end of uh, my Iloilo visit. And now I'm gonna get a taxi and head to the airport. We are going to Cebu. Finally made it. Hopefully, not late. Yeah, I still have one hour, which is good. Two things are here. Please tell me there is AC. Ah, yeah, there is. Okay, good. Oh, what's that door? Okay. Should I un? Oh wow. Well, it's a it's a caged balcony. So we're not gonna use that. Let's see if there is a. Oh, okay. No view, only people drying their clothes. <laughs> All right. Let's <coughs> check the bathroom. Uh, where's the right? Okay, there we go. Yeah. Okay, not bad. Whatever, we'll be underwater all the time, mostly. Can we cook? Can we cook? Can we cook? Yes, we can. And we have pots and frying pan and strainer. Here's the other cutlery here. Okay. And the stove, toaster, rice maker, and a microwave. Is there anything here? Oh, that's. Butter. <laughs> Finally made it. Uh, <clears throat> funny thing is, so far, like I get in the airplane, and then without even realizing, 
prepare for landing. I'm like, what? It's been only 20 minutes. So yeah, that's actually fun. And now I think I'm gonna freshen up, get ready. Um, I'll start exploring outside. It's a very long walk from my apartment to the entrance, so this will suck. And it's really hot. I think it's 40 degrees here. All right, so I found a <coughs> dive center about uh, 30 minutes walk from here. So, uh, I'm gonna go there and maybe start booking. My next three days of diving. And hopefully, it goes good. So, let's go. bad idea it's extremely hot um like every part of my body is swimming sw sweating right now extremely hot and sadly uh, yeah I encountered something dangerous so I'll talk about it in the end of this video I don't want to talk about it right now since I'm safe uh, and after the incident, I walked way further than uh, expected and I missed the turn. Now I have to go all the way back, not all the way, maybe half the way, and try to figure out uh, where's that diving shop. Sorry? Yeah. Per each? Yeah. That's weird. Normally it's by kilo, right? Only the PS per kilo. Yeah, I'm always pretty. Thank you. Okay, thank you. It's very really funny that I'm looking for a dive shop instead I'm buying fruits now. I guess because I'm hungry, so I'm trying to pack for my room when I get back. Yeah. So I'll finish up here and uh, get a taxi and go to the that shop so basically you can buy like a whole meal all you have to do is cook it for 34 pesos well all right then I'm gonna get it hello guys <clears throat> uh, yeah it was a very hard day to be honest Uh, I almost got Hold up So Just because I had some bad experiences in Cebu Cebu, sorry That doesn't mean That I'm gonna discredit every nice people I've met Let's be honest here Yes, there are bad people in everywhere in the world 
but I had wonderful experiences as well. And since bad guys tend to be more prevalent in social media, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to discredit the good guys here. Like the taxi driver who stayed with me just after hearing the story and he wanted me to have a good time and he stayed with me for four hours taking me in every dive shop until we found a good one. And like the people I met randomly and I spoke to and talked to and we exchanged numbers and we're good friends and we keep talking and I gained followers out of them. And the amazing people, how can I forget them from Sun and, dive, uh, Sun and Fun Dive Center. Dive Resort, sorry. Okay. Uh, Bonnet, the tour guide. What a wonderful girl. She went through a lot of hardships in life and still, you always see her smiling and she's always happy to see you and everything. Remy, the dive master. What a wonderful guy. Made everything easy. And Miss V, the manager of the dive resort. I booked my diving uh, trips and everything was planned. I went to dive. I couldn't dive. Not even a single dive. And still, I suck it up. I got the loss. And I'm like, okay, you know what? I will just, can I go Can I go on island hopping instead? And they're like, of course you can. So they were very accommodating. And they helped me through everything. Uh, also with the food, they accommodated my food choices. And guess what? At the end, I didn't ask for it. They gave me a refund because I, I booked for diving and I didn't dive. So they gave me a refund to compensate. I never asked them for that. I never asked anybody of that. Uh, sorry, for that. But still. So, Cebu. Cebu, the good people of Cebu. I love you guys. And I love Cebu. Thank you so much for that wonderful experience. And I will never forget you. And you guys be damn sure. Uh, Fun and Sun Dive Resort. You have my business every day now. Thank you so much for this. So, let's watch some of the clips because we had wonderful time in there. Good morning. So, I've uh, relocated for uh, three days only. I'm going to be staying in this uh, dive resort. Uh, looks amazing here, actually. I'm just... 10 steps away from the ocean, so, I mean, from the beach, sorry. So that's good. And now, I got the room. It's nothing special, so I'm not gonna take videos about it. Uh, yeah, let me show you the place. Let's go. Hello. Morning, hello. Morning.
we are finally on the boat. It's a very tiny boat, but it's only three of us, so that feels like more private. And I'm gonna set up the gear now, and we're going to dive. So, let's ride. Email the last, so then they're sinking. Or BCD, oh no, pins uh, on first, and then suddenly they're on they're 50 meters away, and they can't get back to the yeah. Good morning, my beautiful subscribers. As you can tell, I'm here in this diving resort. I booked a room, so I stay closer because it's one hour drive from my other condo. And as you can hear me, I am still very sick. So basically, I am unfit for diving, which means the next best thing is to go on island hopping tour. So I'm going to have breakfast and let's start the day. First, take a look at this view. So tell me, don't you want to wake up every day to this view? I mean, look at that. <coughs> Sorry. I still wish that this view could get me recovered. Oh well. It's going to be a great day. What's wrong with you? Huh? What are you doing? Where are you going? So you can explain that the dogs look different in the Philippines. Yeah, this is a Filipino dog. <laughs> Excuse me. Where did he turn up? It was by bottles. Way up here? Yeah. Ah, oh, they're smooth shelled. Give a nasty pinch. Ah, you gonna let it go? There we go. Yeah. Nice. You can eat it. Yeah. These actually, I think I've had these and they taste, uh, they taste like old mud. <laughs> Two for different